Yes, hello everyone. This video today is a video that I must do, that I have to do for people. And, I mean, I've been getting messages and, you know, personal, mess personal messages and um, all that things about um, how to add more IPs to the block list instead of one link. Okay, um, I'm sorry if I didn't have this last time, but... Um, I just figured it out myself, not not just recently, but um, I had um, looked underneath the views um, IP block list um, feature, and it says it can take text documents. And I was like, oh, okay, now I see because you know I took the time out to read, and I'm going to show you all how you can block the IPs, you know, or get more IPs on the block list. And it's very easy. It's easier than you think. Um, and you can put as many lists as you want down um, on the list. So this is a video that will show you how you can do it. And, you know, I it's by popular demand. People have been asking me and personal messaging me all the time, every week, every day, how to um, add more IPs to the list. Okay, um, you remember this video? Um, <clears throat> I showed you how to do it at first. Okay, and now, now we're going to go back to this website. Okay, you see, we got this. We got to this website, and grab the IPs that you want to um, that you want to add to the list. So I want the level one. I'm gonna click the level one. It's gonna bring this up. Now you download this. I'm going to download them all. Um, I'm gonna put this to my desktop as of right now. Okay, there we go. And I want the spyware. Let me see. Do I want the spyware? Hmm. I don't want that many. Um, let's get this hacker one. This hijack. Where's the... Okay, I'm going to click here. Well, they didn't give me the download link, but um, what you're going to do is, if you ever get this, just copy... Oh wait, let me see if they got um, select all up here. Yes, yeah, select all. Well, select all. Copy. Okay, now you're going to want to make a text document, a plain text document like this one. I name you can name it um, your block list so you can remember it or whatever. Open it. It's blank, and I'm going to paste this in there. Okay, there we go. We got the IPs in there. Now I want to get one more. Where's the hacker one? Um, okay, and I want the hacker one right here. So I click this link. It's going to want me to download this one. So you download it to my desktop. All right. Now that I'm done with that, I'm going to X out my um, browser. Yes, I'm gonna clear it. Okay. Um, now we're gonna come over here, open up this zip file, drag this out, or you can um, right-click and um, you know get it out yourself. And I want to get this one as well. This is um, level one. Drag that one out. Okay, let me get out of there. Now I'm going to open the level one with the, no, I'm just going to double click on it. It's going to ask me what do I want to open it with, so I'm going to say notepad. Okay, it's opening up this one, level one, um, notepad right here, and it's going to give me a whole list of IPs. Just waiting for it to open it up here, because there are a lot of IPs on this one. Okay, now it has opened, and going to click edit and select all copy now come to my custom um, block list right here with the um, other list that I put in here the hijack list and I'm going to come down here and I'm going to paste because there are a lot of IPs so it might take a while okay I just pasted the um, the level one right here so I'm going to X that out the level one I don't want that anymore so I'm going to move that over there, that um, file. 
Now I'm going to open up the hacker one. The um, yeah, okay. Use Notepad. Here's the hacker list. So I'm going to select all again. Copy. Close this window. Come down here, all the way down here where it's blinking, and paste. Oops, look like it. Wait, did it get rid of it? I hope it didn't. Um, so I'm going to save it. And now what I have just did was created a custom. Don't want to mess with those files. Um, right here, I made a custom made block list with all of those IPs that they um give you. So now open up your views. Go to tools. Come down here to options. Make sure you're set to advanced um user. Come down here to IP filters. Come right here. Click this blue folder. Now find the um here it is right here, the text document. Make sure it's saved as a text document. C uh, click it, press open. And hold on, let me make sure that that's the right one that I'm copying. Okay, yeah. And now click load. Now what this is going to do, it's going to load up all of the um, IPs that you just copied and pasted into that text um, document. So it might take a while, or it might take a few seconds or a few minutes, I don't know, it, it depends. So let's sit here and wait. Okay, there we go, it had just loaded all of these IPs that you just added. So there you go. All of them, right there. You can even click um, description and look at them in alphabetical order and there you go you can look at them in alphabetical order if you want so yeah and now that you have all those IPs you click apply click apply and then you you press up oh, antivirus started right there you click apply and then you press close and there you go you just added more than one IP um, block list so you know if you um have any more questions just um you know contact me and I'll get to you and make sure to um you know update the the list ever so often you know get rid of those old IPs and replace them with the newer ones like every seven weeks or so that's what they say um when they update it so or you can check um blocklist.com and see when the, when they update their list all the time you know every time so yeah this has been a video that has been you know in high demand, you know, everyone wanted to know how to do it. So here it is. I hope this has been helpful. See you all later. Dabbing the Geek Out. Thank you for watching. Peace.